Namaste. Come laying on your back. Knees are bent, feet wide, knees together. Hands on the belly. Just taking some deep breaths here as you prepare yourself for this core awakening flow. I'll be sharing with you three different techniques to enliven your core, to awaken the lower belly, and to activate the abs. As you're ready, release the hands either side of the hips, knees are above the ankles. Take a block, a pillow or some books and place it between the thighs so the knees remain hip width apart and active. Heels towards the sitting bones. As you're ready, we're going to inhale, press into the feet, lift the hips. Exhaling, gently lower the hips down. So as we inhale, we're rolling up the spine. Exhaling, gently roll back down the spine. Feel the vertebrae coming into contact with the mat one by one. Continuing on at your own time. Squeezing the block between the thighs. Adjusting the feet if you need to, to make sure the heels remain close to the sitting bones. And pressing into the hands as well. Coming as high as feels good in your body. And remember throughout this practice you can rest at any time. So as you're ready, release the block to one side. In Placing both hands on the belly, just taking some deep breaths here, just tuning in, seeing how you feel in your belly, knees together, feet wide as before, releasing the lower back. When you're ready to move on, interlock the fingers behind you, draw in the knees, straighten the legs. As we exhale, we're going to bend the right leg, left leg lengthens above the mat, inhale, feet together. Left leg bends, right leg straightens, feet together. Right leg bends, left leg straightens, feet together. Left leg bends, right leg straightens, feet together. So continuing on your own time. Keep the legs active by spreading the toes. Head is resting in the hands, space between the chin and the chest. You're welcome to do as many rounds of these as you like. Next time the legs come together, right knee bends, left arm reaches to the outside of the right knee. Legs together, exhaling, left knee bends, right arm reaches to the outside of the thigh. Right knee bends, left arm reaches across, legs together. Left arm bends, right arm reaches across. So relaxing the head in the hands and to engage even more, try and lift the shoulder blades off the mat as well. Shoulders away from the ears, space between the chin and the chest. So as before, you can do as many rounds of these as you like, resting when you need to. And of course, making sure that there's no pushing or straining when you're done, hug in the knees, spiral the knees away from each other. Knees together. Interlock the first three fingers and thumb, extend the arms and the legs away from each other. As you exhale now, lift the legs, draw the hands through the thighs. Inhale, extending away from each other. Exhale, drawing them through. So we're working a little deeper now, lifting the shoulder blades to deepen the activation in the core. And once again, you can do as many rounds of these as you like, resting when you need to. We hug in the knees. Arms out at shoulder height, release the knees 
to the right, head is neutral, or look to the left, breathing into the left side waist. And then as you're ready, knees through center, changing sides, knees to the left, head is neutral, or looking to the right, breathing into the right side waist. Inhale, knees through center, hugging in the knees, chin to chest, forehead to the knees. And exhaling, feet on the mat, feet wide, knees together, releasing tension in the lower back, both hands on the belly, just taking some breaths here, tuning in, seeing how you feel. Hands in Anjali Mudra. Namaste.